Thrivecart versus Samcart. Which shopping cart is right for you in your business to help you get to the next level? Personally, I use both of these shopping carts in on multiple brands. I've run over $4 million through Samcart. I've run over a million dollars through Thrivecart, and I actually use them differently. And that's what I wanna help you understand is the best use case for each one so you can figure out which one is right for you. We're also gonna talk a little bit about the company histories from both of those companies so you can get an idea of the trajectory they're on and what direction that they're going. You're gonna learn where to find the best deal on each or both of these. And then also you'll learn about the bonus that I'm willing to offer you if you sign up through my affiliate link. I am an affiliate, full disclosure, but my main intention here is to really just help you choose the right tool for the job so you can move forward confidently. And the first question that most people have is, Miles, why aren't you using one of the super hyped, overhyped and promoted uh, all-in-one funnel builders like ClickFunnels or Go High Level or whatever the next funnel builder of the month club is? And that's a great question. Question. So I have tried those before, um, but what I've found is that when I'm using an all-in-one system that manages my landing page, it also manages my checkout pages, it also manages my product delivery, and it also manages my email system. If there's one glitch inside of one of those components, I literally have to throw the entire thing away and move 100% of my business to a new platform. Okay, this is like looking at the machine that runs the cash flow of your business as a disposable item. Now, I used ClickFunnels for quite some time, and they were very glitchy in how they managed my recurring transactions. And several customers who were not paying me were actually getting access to my ongoing products when their system should have removed that. So instead of being able to just go remove the shopping cart component and switch it out with a new shopping cart, I had to literally migrate everything away. So I have kind of designed my business. So my landing page builder is just that it's a landing page builder. If they give me problems, if they jack up the prices too much, if they glitch out and literally just don't perform appropriately, all I have to do is go switch out my landing page builder. Same with my email autoresponder system, right? If my email autoresponder system starts glitching out on me or if they give me problems, I download my list, I go to a new email autoresponder system, I upload my list and I'm back to work and I don't have to fiddle with all my products and I don't have to fiddle with all my delivery pages. And the same is true for my shopping cart, okay? So with each and every one of these shopping carts, if, if they give me troubles or if they keep trying to squeeze more money out of me and I'm like, I don't know if I wanna pay all that extra money from y'all, then what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna go take my products and go replace them with a new shopping cart. And I love this modular approach Approach to building my business, I feel like it gives me the most freedom and flexibility moving forward, which is why I like having a dedicated shopping cart that does nothing other than convert sales and allows people to buy in and get access to their products. And that's one of the cool things. So both of these shopping carts technically do the same thing. You can set up your products, you can set up recurring charges, you can set up beautiful landing pages and checkout pages. When they purchase, they both have like learn centers. So they actually will be your learning management system so they can deliver and fulfill those orders when people purchase. You know, from a technical standpoint, they're the exact same. The one use case that I think Thrivecart has an advantage over Samcart is on recurring memberships and recurring charges. So the way that Thrivecart handles and processes recurring charges for me as the actual like CEO and CFO of my business, it's a superior model. Because what Thrivecart does is Thrivecart creates either a Stripe ongoing agreement or it creates a PayPal ongoing agreement at Stripe or PayPal. Now in Samcart, Samcart manages that monthly recurring payment inside of Samcart, which means if I decide to go move and replace one of them, I lose all of those recurring charges that are all built up. So if you go get 100 customers on your membership program paying you $39 per month, like high five, you're getting residual cash flow, which is great. But if you're on Samcart, you're kind of stuck on Samcart. If you move to a new shopping cart, you lose all of those ongoing contracts for where all the money comes from. Whereas Thrivecart, Thrivecart doesn't manage those internally on Thrivecart. Thrivecart actually allows you to manage them directly with the processors that you own. Now that's a really geeky and technical thing, but this is why I use Thrivecart for all of my products that have, all of my memberships, everything I have that 
that that's recurring, um, right? The recurring rebuild type products I like to run on Thrivecart, but that's really the one and only use case that is different between them. It kind of comes down from there to what deal is best for you. So let's first jump on my computer. And then I want to show you one of my checkout pages from both Thrivecart and Samcart you for the same product. So you can kind of just see the defaults of how they go. So right here, we are on Samcart, okay? And this is for my opt-in template book. And you can see it's a beautiful checkout page. So we've got a two column. I like to use the two column. They all have a bunch of different templates. Uh, Samcart has way more templates than Thrivecart does, but that doesn't really matter to me personally. I wanna find one consistent template that I can use over and over. And I go with this kind of a two column style. I like to have a headline up here and then I've got an image and then I've got some bullet points. I repeat my 100 percent money back guarantee and then they got their checkout area and you can see down here I can run multiple bump offers on side of Thrive on side inside of Samcart excuse me um, on Thrivecart you can only run one bump offer at a time but all in all it's a beautiful page these pages are extremely simple and extremely quick to build if I had to uh, tip my hat to the one that is fastest to create a beautiful looking page it's going to be Samcart so for the iPhone users who are okay paying more money for the same thing because you like iPhones and pretty things and that matters to you Samcart is the direction that someone who really cares about um, all of those kinds of style-based things. Now, this same page built out on Thrivecart, it looks pretty similar, right? It's a little bit less clean. You notice that the columns are not equal width here. We've got a little bit less space on the left column, but if we go back and forth between these two, I mean, it's not that much of a big deal. I honestly kind of like that I have more width here on my bump offer. I think the bump offer actually displays a little bit better here, but I've got a lot more customization potential on Samcart for that bump offer than I do. And I've tested on my wife's brand, We've tested up to like four different um, bump offers and we've found that three, two and three works very, very consistently. People will absolutely add more and more products. So what that allows you to do is increase your average order value, right? So this is a $9 product, but when I've got a $17 offer and a $7 offer there, um, we can actually get them all the way up to $38. Excuse me, it's $14 for it uh, on this test. I test prices a lot. Um, so you can see that I can actually get my average order value up or my, my cart value up to $38 because I have multiple bump offers, which is great. Uh, over here, if I add on, this is a different bump offer. So I get one thing. So I'm trying a, a higher value bump offer here. And you can just see it. They're both clean. They both work. They're both very, very simple. Um, and that's what I like about them. Now, if you get into kind of the fancier stuff where you want to run bumps and then you want to run upsells and you want to run multiple upsells or multiple upsells and downsells, they both can handle that like a breeze. Um, it's really easy to set up. It's a little bit different in each of them. I would say that the user interface and the dashboard on Samcart is a scotch cleaner. Uh, Thrivecart feels a little bit clunkier, but honestly, Thrivecart being a fixed price, a one-time fee versus having a monthly payment, that might be worth dealing with the tiny bit of clunkiness. Uh, again, I think it's worth reiterating, they're both bulletproof, right? Like I've run millions and millions of dollars through both of these and they just work. They they don't fail trans transactions, they just freaking work, which is obviously when someone's got their credit card in hand and they want to buy from you, you need that thing to work. And which when ClickFunnels was glitching out on me over and over and over again, I was like, oh my God, I had to change my entire business around. So looking at the businesses and the companies themselves. Now, Samcart has done two VC rounds and VC stands for venture capital, but I personally like to recall, uh, I, I like to think of VC as vulture capital. Okay. And you'll understand why in a minute. So at this point, Sam cart has raised $95 million from outside investors. And these are generally people from Silicon Valley who want to get a high return on their investment. Okay. These are the people who hope they put money in at a $95 million valuation, or they put 95 million in and they want to pull their money out when it becomes a billion dollar brand. They want to have another unicorn on their hands. And Thrivecart has also taken on some funding. Okay. They took on $35 million in funding. So both companies have now said to the vulture capitals of the world, bring me your money. I want a payday and I want money in order to expand. But what this means is there's now a group of investors who are expecting to get 
paid, which means I'm expecting both of these platforms to squeeze me more and more. It's much more apparent on Samcart right now than it is on Thrivecart. So Samcart is really pushing a lot of their alternative things. So if you want premium priority support, now you got to pay 19 bucks a month in addition to their monthly fee on Samcart. If you want advanced analytics, now you got to pay extra money to get analytics, advanced analytics, and they just seem to be raising their prices and squeezing and, oh, if you want educational content, now you got to pay for the creator university. And it's one of those scenarios, and I don't love this. And this is one of the things that repulsed me from um, ClickFunnels, to be honest, was like now that you're buying their expensive software that's supposed to give you the solution, now you gotta buy this, and then you gotta buy that, and then you gotta buy this, and you gotta buy that, and it's like, good Lord, like get out of my wallet, y'all. Just just go be a great shopping cart tool and let me go sell my products, and let's just let that be. So from that perspective, so far to date, Thrivecart's doing much better. Now, Thrivecart is currently a one-time fee. You pay once, you get access for life. And there's a lot of people like myself who are wondering if that's going to change. Are they going to change it over to a monthly payment option? Because if Thrivecart becomes $95 per month, boy, it, that's gonna really increase the lifetime fee for users. So right now you do have the ability to get full lifetime access to Thrivecart at one time fee. And it does appear that that's gonna be grandfathered in and locked in, <clears throat> excuse me. Thrivecart is now offering a pro level. So there's like a 195 upsell for the Thrivecart Pro. Thrivecart is also starting to offer um, advanced learn options. So I upgraded my learn, which is where I deliver my products because I needed the ability to upload and import customers. And if you want the ability to import customers, then you got to pay that 195. But all of the upsells that I've seen inside of Thrivecart are still one-time fee. So what my hope is, is that Thrivecart actually kind of remains as the one-time fee product and they like allow that to be a part of their branding and a part of their positioning. Whereas Samcart, everything's monthly or yearly and they keep trying to add on more and more and more monthly and yearly things for you to buy. Now, I do over a million dollars per year in my business and I have done for years on years on end. I don't like spending 50 bucks more or a hundred bucks more. I grew up frugal. I don't know what it is, but like when I feel like someone's just squeezing me because I'm doing well with their tool, it just makes me want to go get a tool that's not going to like squeeze me and try to take advantage of me because I'm actually being successful. And that is something that seeing that Samcart has taken on $95 million in two separate VC rounds, right? They did 10 million and then they did like 82 million. I don't know where that other three came from, but that just has me more worried about the long-term direction of where they're going. Cause we've seen it with um, Infusionsoft or Keep. We've seen it with uh, Clavio. We've seen it with so many different companies that are service providers for us internet entrepreneurs that they you know bootstrap together a piece of software it works they grow an audience who gets good with it and then they take on outside money and they just tighten the screws and they just try to squeeze more and more juice out of each and every customer and i just that business model kind of annoys me and repulses me. Maybe it's because I grew up in the Bay Area and I've seen a lot of what the uh, VC industry can do to a city. If you look at San Francisco, if you look at an area, I mean, it is not all uh, roses and rainbows and unicorns in the vulture capital world from my personal opinion. But moving forward, let's talk about the deal, okay? Like what is the cost to get into both of them? Because surprisingly, it's actually less expensive to get into Samcart. Now, as an affiliate for both of these, um, I have the ability to go find the best deals within the affiliate dashboard, right? Their homepage doesn't actually give you the best deal. So on Samcart, if you go to milesbeckler.com forward slash Samcart bundle, you'll find this particular offer here. And again, if you order through my links, I'll talk about the bonus that you'll get here in a minute um, because I will give you some of my products as a bonus for signing up for either one of these if you sign up through my affiliate link, right? Because that becomes a win-win scenario. I get a commission, you pay the exact same amount, and I'll give you some of my best selling products as well at no charge to you. So the milesbeckler.com forward slash Samcart bundle, Samcart dash bundle, the link is in the description. What you get is you get a lot of their courses and a lot of their content to teach you how to really step up your sales letters, how to build off of their frameworks, how to write a sales letter that's gonna convert. And I like that. I do appreciate when a company that runs a tool is gonna to give me the educational content that I need in order to succeed with their tool. On Thrivecart, you just get the tool. 
Okay. It's, it's bare bones and, and here it is and figure it out. And there's some helpful, there's a lot of helpful YouTube videos. It's not difficult to figure out by any means, but, um, you know, you get, uh, Brian Moran's one page masterclass, right? The one page workshop. This is the idea of build your sales page and your checkout page together in one. That's what you're seeing here. So this is technically a one page funnel, right? So it's the sales letter and it's the checkout page all in one. So he teaches you how to build that out in his style. Um, they've got their traffic tactics course. They've got the one page launch formula. So you can do the launches, you get his swipe file, you get the product creation masterclass. So if you're not great at creating products yet, if you haven't created a bunch of products and you're like, yes, I want to sell my own products, but I don't know what I need to create with my product. And I know I need the software tool. Bingo. Sam cart just rose to the top of your list because they do have wonderful educational content. So this product creation masterclass is designed to help you create a one problem solution product. Okay. Um, those would generally be like low ticket, um, entry level products, which convert like freaking crazy. This is what I use. I use this all the time. My wife and I have sold millions of dollars of products that were seven, nine, 11, uh, $27 and under $47. I would say over half of our five plus million dollars of our own products that we've sold over half of that has been products that are less than $47 because we follow a very similar approach to creating these very specific solutions to very specific problems, which means you can create the courses quickly. You can create the products quickly. You can test them and sell them quickly. And it's helped us build a large inventory of digital businesses. So from that standpoint of learning how to great, create great products, learning how to craft great sales letters, how to put it all together, how to test a bunch of ideas to find those two or three products that scale that you can run over and over and over. Honestly, I kind of think that Sam cart has an edge on that side of it. Uh, Brian Moran is a great marketer. He's been a great marketer for, for decades at this point, he's old school internet marketing. And so it's not just a tech geek who decided to create a shopping cart, which appears to be more of what thrive cart was. This is a internet marketer who is very skilled. He was in the baseball niche teaching uh, kids how to play baseball earlier. Um, and he had other niche sites as well, but he created a shopping cart that he wanted as a marketer so he could do bumps, multiple bumps, upsells, upsell, downsell chains, et cetera, et cetera. Um, you get coaching calls, you get into their Facebook group, you get their upsell blueprint, you get their Facebook ads Academy. So you get all of this. Uh, I, I don't actually think the total value is $15,000. I think they're just making shit up at that point in time, to be perfectly honest with you, but it is, there is a lot of value on this and you can get it started for just $349 today. And that's for one year. And that's a yearly fee. So that means next year you would have to pay $349 as well. Now, when we contrast this to Thrivecart, Thrivecart's going to cost you more in the first year, but you ain't going to have a payment in the second year. Okay. And that's something you need to think about, but you're also not going to get the educational content on Thrivecart that you would on Samcart. Now this breaks down to just over, like, it's just under like 30 bucks a month, right? So 30 bucks a month would be $360 per year. So from a software tool perspective for a shopping cart, that's not a, not a very, um, it's not a bad deal, right? It's actually good. I'll call it a good deal instead of call it a not bad deal, right? That's a pretty good deal. Um, personally, I skipped the one traffic hack, but what you need to know with Samcart is you might need to upgrade to their grow platform. And so their grow platform is $950 per year. And in order to get the upsells, that's where you actually need to have the Sam cart grow. So this is the package that I signed up for with miles Beckler in order to have the add-ons and the upsells. If you're just trying to get your first product to sale, you're trying to find that lightning strike and you want to catch lightning in a bottle. You want to create your first product and get your first sales. And you don't have uh, inventory to add on as bumps and upsells yet. Then the smallest level of Sam cart launch will work for you, but you need to know once you have three or four products and you want to add a bump and you want to add an upsell and you want to play these kind of fancier games, that's when you're either going to need to upgrade to Sam cart grow, which is an additional $600 per year. And then if you want to get their affiliate module, if you want to turn on the digital wallets, meaning you want to accept Apple pay and Android pay and those kinds of things, which I have tested and it has actually increased my conversions. Then you need to go up to $199 per month, which ends up being about $2,400 per year. Okay. So the top line, top of the game, Sam cart level is going to cost you about $2,400 per year. Now, if you are 
not selling products yet, if you're early on your journey, then you might be in a position where Samcart could actually be more helpful for you as a beginner to start to create and test and sell products to figure out what works for your audience earlier. This is what I used on the Miles Beckler brand, okay? So when I first started going right here on Samcart, that's what you're looking at. I was on, I literally bought this bundle myself, that same bundle I'm talking to you about, and I've been testing things and I've created probably about 60 or 70 small products like my opt-in template book. I have a bump template book. You'll see some of my other templates because that's a part of the bonus, right? I'm, I'm giving you a bonus of all of my templates to make it easy to create the different components for this for you. So I've been testing all of this on Samcart. And now that I really feel like I've got kind of my main idea on what I want to do and I want to add on a recurring, um, I'm going to start a mastermind program where uh, I'll start to do multiple calls each and every month with students so I can be there to help students answer their question. The fact that I'm going to be adding on a recurring fee product to the Miles Beckler brand. And now that I really have tested so many different things over the last year or two, I'm actually moving away from Samcart onto Thrivecart because I don't want to go up and pay $2,400 per year to have an affiliate program to be able to accept Apple Pay when all of that is actually included on Thrivecart. So if you get going with Thrivecart, milesbeckler.com forward slash Thrivecart is my affiliate link. Um, you get a lifetime account, but with the lifetime account, you immediately get the ability to sell, to have your bumps. You have the upsells are built right in, okay? You would have to upgrade on the SAM cart in order to get those two components. So everything else the same, and you also get Apple Pay, okay? So you get the bumps, the upsells, the Apple Pay, all of that stuff works out of the box with the 495 one-time fee here on um, Samcart. Now you're gonna notice if I click the lifetime account, they have an upsell, which is the pro upgrade. I haven't upgraded to pro yet, okay? They're, they they have special dunning, which is um, if someone's on a subscription and they fall off of a subscription, an email series that goes out to say, hey, by the way, go update your credit card information, right? Their, their credit card expired. And so if you want those kinds of automations, you can add it on for 195. And then on the learn side, I do believe they have a 195 upsell in there. But to the best of my knowledge, the highest that you would end up paying on all of Thrivecart as of this recording is about $750. And all you need to get started to, to figure out what sells and what you're going to sell over and over and what can I add as a bump and building all of this out, um, then the 495 package is perfect. So out of the box, you're gonna pay more than to get started with Thrivecart than you would with Samcart. And this is why I was like, I have to make a video about this because this is like confusing, right? Like you have to make a decision and there's benefits to both directions. So my approach through all of this was, I'm gonna start with Samcart. I'm gonna go with there. Personally, I knew I wanted to run bumps and upsells immediately. So I went with Samcart Grow out of the box because I knew I wanted to be able to sell a $7 product on the front end, have a nine or a 19 or a $20 bump, and then show a $47 upsell. Because for me, I needed to be able to have my cart value, right? And I needed to be able to make $60, $70 per customer in order to run Facebook ads. That's the cost of running Facebook ads because I got to pay per click and it costs more and more to run ads. So I need the ability to increase my average order value. And that's kind of why I went with Samcart. And also it really helped me a ton, to be perfectly honest with you. Um, it helped me a ton to, to learn from these guys. Like they're really smart marketers. So if you're currently doing coaching, you're doing one-on-one -on -one consulting, you're doing one-on-one -on -one sessions with people and you want to start offering, you want to keep that going and you want to start offering like one-to-many or uh, digital downloadable products. And you want to try to codify and productize what you do so you can start having automated sales. The fact that you get all of these bonuses on Samcart may actually be the deciding factor of why Samcart's a better value for you to get going. I think personally, <clears throat> excuse me. Personally, I went straight to the upgrade to the Samcart Grow because I knew on that first year I wanted all of it. And I didn't want to have to pay full price upgrade later. Um, if you're just trying to get started and you just want to start selling one-off products, uh, the Samcart launch, just getting all that education and getting the tool to sell, this technically is everything that you need. Over here on Thrivecart, 
it's a wonderful deal. If you already have products, if you already have, if you're leaving one of the funnel builders and you have a few things going on already, and you're just like, man, I want to go take what's working over here. I'm tired of paying two 97 a month for glitch funnels. I want to go get something else. I mean, hell like literally glitch funnels is $297 a month two months of glitch funnels and you're you're like literally done for life you're paid for life so if you have a few things going on if you've tested you know your core products you have a bump you have an upsell you have some things that work thrivecart is the fastest way to go plug in play and go but if you don't know what you're creating if you don't know exactly what you're going to sell if you haven't proven that you can get lightning to strike and when i say lightning strikes i'm talking about making sales right if you can't make that cash register ring yet you don't know what to sell you don't know who to sell it to i think samcart is the the early earlier option. And so what I did is I got going for a year and my one year is coming up fairly soon and I'm closing one of my Samcart accounts. Uh, I'm going to keep the other one up and running and I'm migrating it over to Thrivecart because I now have the data. I have the information. I have the insights to do. Um, I don't have loyalty in that sense to their brand. I'm not here to shill their brand only to you. Uh, I'm not here to drink the Kool-Aid and join the cult of scammers at glitch funnels. I'm here to build up in business. If you know what I'm saying, right? I'm the CFO. I'm the CTO. I'm the CEO. That means I'm the chief financial officer. I'm the chief technology officer, and I am the chief executive officer of this business. I need to do what's right for my business. I have to monitor how much I'm spending. I need to monitor how much I'm earning. I need to look at my partners, my tech partners, where are they going? What kind of squeezes are they going to put on me in the future? And I need to make executive decisions. Now for my other brand that I have, my bigger brand that's run over $4 million through one Sam card account, there's no way in heck I'm changing that. Okay. So if you have a really high volume business, meaning you're making dozens of sales a day, you're making hundreds of sales per week. What Thrivecart doesn't have that Samcart does have is some really cool split testing options. You have the ability to split test your opt-in pages and you have the ability to split test your upsell flows much easier, upsell and downsell flows much easier than you do on Thrivecart. But in order to actually take advantage of that technology, you need to have a lot of conversions coming in. So my wife's brand does well over 10,000. I think it's closer to like 20, thousand sales per year transactions per year uh, so for us the ability to test bumps to test checkout pages to test um, upsell flows that really helps us maximize and improve our conversion rates because we have enough data right and in order to have enough data you have to have statistical significance which means if you don't have hundreds of sales coming through the data behind it, a split test won't won't make any sort of sense right if you're only getting three or four sales per day or uh 10 sales per week or yeah 10 sales per week it'll take you 50 weeks to get 500 sales, which is the kind of data you would need to have statistical significance from one of those split tests. So um, all of that just really means that if you have a really high volume business, if you, if you are making hundreds of transactions per week, there is also potentially a little bit of an advantage. So for wifey's brand, I spend the $2,400 per month, or I mean, excuse me, per year for the top level of Samcart. And it, earns back more than it costs me due to the fact that I have tens of thousands of transactions coming in and we're able to test things faster and faster on that. So those are the main ideas. I hope this has been helpful. Let's talk about the bonus that you can get if you purchase either one of these from my, uh, from my link specifically. So again, um, in order to claim the bonuses, what you need to do is you need to buy through my link and it needs to show up in my affiliate dashboard that you did purchase. So clear your cookies from your computer, from your browser. Before you do this, make sure you're not running an ad blocker. Make sure you're not running a cookie or a pop-up blocker, and then go through either milesbeckler.com forward slash samcart dash bundle. The link will be below or go to milesbeckler.com forward slash thrivecart in order to buy that. And you'll get my affiliate link there and then purchase. Once you get your receipt, with my affiliate ID after purchasing through mine, you can email your receipt to support at milesbeckler.com. Okay, just support at milesbeckler.com and send us your receipt. And what we'll do is we will add this template bundle to your email address that you purchased through and you'll get access to my Thrivecart account, right? So I deliver all of this through Thrivecart because I've done kind of completed that migration over. And it's really not that big of a deal to, to migrate everything over. And again, the benefit of thinking about my business 
modularly, right? I have an email system for me to move my products from Samcart over to Thrivecart. I didn't have to touch my email system. I don't have to touch my tags that I have set up. I don't have to touch any of my automations. I don't have to touch my landing page builders. All I got to go do is just change my links from my Samcart links over my Thrivecart links. You know, it's a afternoon or an evening of work. Um, honestly, my virtual assistant is doing everything for me. It's, it's something my VA can do everything, but Let's go ahead and wrap and talk about the bonuses here. So um, you get the high converting opt-in page template. Um, that's actually the first book that I showed you, the email opt-in template. Um, this is to help you maximize your list growth. I think even though we're talking a lot about shopping carts here, you gotta grow your email list. And this high converting opt-in page template will help you understand how I create opt-in pages that convert 60 to 75% of visitors into subscribers. Um, the Facebook ad blueprint templates, right? I did a deep dive study on over a thousand Facebook ads on what works, what doesn't, on Facebook ads, how to write really good ads that won't get your account banned. That's all in there. The email list, gr list growth mastery course, this really goes into the nuts and bolts behind growing your email list. You get the million dollar OTO template. So this is the page that we show after someone opts in. This can be displayed on either a Samcart one-page checkout uh, or a, a one-page funnel or on a Thrivecart one-page funnel. You can do a one-page funnel on both of them. The one-click upsell template, obviously, once somebody checks out, you show them an upsell. This is my template for creating upsells. That thing crushes it. I mean, some of my upsells do 38 to 40% of people who bought product A also add on product B, and it just increases my average order value. The bump offer template, you saw the bumps. You do need to go to a higher level of SAM cart in order to get, uh, in order to add on one click upsells and to add on bumps. If you sign up for the basic level of Thrivecart, you can get, uh, you can start running bumps and one click upsells immediately. So you can implement and use my templates, but the bumps are those little check boxes on the checkout page. And I, I show you my template for how to get those done. The breakthrough sales letter template. If you have a great product and your sales letter stinks, you're not going to make any sales. So you have to write great sales letter copy. So this breaks down the process of writing a full sales letter kind of block by block by block. It makes it really simple. So we zero in on the headline, you get your headline done, you zero in on the lead, you get your lead done, you zero in on all the bits and pieces in the correct order. And it kind of prompts you and gives you some fill in the blank templates. So you can kind of just go through the book and write out with notes and based on the promptings as you go, and you're going to have the shell and the outline of a sales letter that has a really high likelihood of actually working. And again, the reason I'm giving you these is you get similar stuff to this if you buy on Samcart, right? Like they actually do offer their version of the one page masterclass and the one page workshop, which is essentially a copywriting course. And it's essentially going to templatize their sales material. But if you sign up for Thrivecart, you don't get any of that. Okay. And that's why I was like, I need to add my stuff as a bonus because I do want you to succeed with whichever tool that you decide is right for you. Um, the three secrets VSL template, this video sales letter just absolutely freaking crushes it. So you can get that template there. It also works as it's got kind of a, um, a full sales funnel component because you can create an opt-in page and the opt-in could be free video reveals the secret to blank. And then the video that they just opted in for is your three secrets VSL, right? It's a video sales letter that reveals those three secrets and then it turns and it closes them. Um, it's similar to a webinar, but it's just kind of an on-demand video. Then you get my email autoresponder template and you also get the million dollar copywriting course. This is uh, where my personal copywriting mentor, Terry Dean, who's brilliant. He's taught me so much about copywriting. I had him on for my private members and he taught his five-step process for crafting sales copy that converts. So you can get all of these templates as a bonus. Again, it's a $1,600 bonus here for these templates um, to claim the bonuses. Again, you need to clear your cookies. You need to buy through my link. And then once you purchase, you send your receipt to prove that you purchased through my link. You send it to support at milesbeckler.com. Uh, give us a little bit of time. We are going to then um, log in and make sure that we actually see your transaction showing up on my affiliate dashboard to see that I did indeed actually earn that affiliate income on that. And then once we confirm that, we will send you access. You'll get a link, uh, you get an email for my Thrivecart that'll have either your password or it'll have a link so you can go set up your password and then you can log in and you'll have access to that full bundle inside of the learning management system right there inside of Thrivecart. Ultimately, to grow a business online as a creator where you're selling your own services, your own products, your own consulting, your own coaching, your own mastermind, if you're selling your own stuff, you're going to need to have a shopping cart. 
right? You can go with one of those all in one funnel systems where everybody seems to be in a cult and they're all just raw rawing it. But just know that most of those people who are raw rawing those as the ultimate best shortcut, you're just one away. It's the greatest thing in the world. They're all paid shills. Okay. Those are all affiliates making gigantic commissions by selling you stuff that isn't actually in your best interest. And yes, I am an affiliate. But I've really wanted to take the time to lay this all out for you in a way that you can make the right decision for you. If I wanted to maximize my conversions and I wanted to maximize how much money Miles Beckler was going to make as an affiliate marketer right here and right now, I would be selling you some sort of a scam like glitch funnels or go high level. And I'd be convincing you that you had to have the all in one super extreme because they have the highest affiliate payouts which is why you see most people shilling them over and over. It's not because they work better. It's not because it's better for you in your business, for your long-term security in your business. They're promoting those to you as the ones you need to use because they make a f load of money from it. And that's their way of extracting more money out of your wallet and putting it into their pocket for overpriced software that you actually technically don't need. Think about your business modularly. Be the CEO of your business, be the executive decision maker, be the CTO, the chief technology, choose the technology that fits your goals better and be the CFO, the financial officer, choose the one that's actually best for your budget, for your brand. I personally believe that Samcart and Thrivecart are both wonderful options. I don't think you can go wrong with either of them long term. There are some nuances to how much they cost today. Samcart's a little bit cheaper. You get a lot of training. It's probably going to help you get to where you're catching lightning striking over and over and over faster. Thrivecart, on the other hand, you'll never have to move away from it in the future. You get going. It's a one-time payment. You're done. You're set up. You are getting all of my templates to help you as best as I possibly can to really build that all out in a way that you will see conversions. But long-term, the cost of SAM card over the course of five years gets noteworthy, especially if you grow, right? You could literally get up to $2,400 per year, which means uh, five years at $2,400 per year. That's $10,000. Pause for impact. But that's, that's, those are real dollars, right? 10,000 real dollars. Like that's noteworthy. Like I could buy another sim racing rig, right? I could buy an old V-dub and start playing with a, you know, fixing up like a old 1979 Volkswagen rabbit or some fun car for 10 grand. Uh, whereas Thrivecart, you pay 495 right now, you're in, you're going. Then you do need to learn how to create the products yourself. Uh, that is kind of the one, the one differentiator. If you have questions, you can get at me in the comments below. Um, you can also send questions to support at milesbeckler.com and we will get you access to your bonuses once you get going as soon as we possibly can. I thank you. I hope this has been helpful. Let me know what you think and I'll catch you on the next video. Till then, be well.